Okay. Ooh, excuse me. Hello, Virgos. How you doing? This is keeping it classy. All right. I'm doing your romance of a lifetime reading on why they walked away. All right. You guys, please hit the notification button below to be notified when I post a video. All right. Like, share this video. Hit the join button to become a member of my channel. Most of all, new viewers, please subscribe. Okay. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. All right. So, please subscribe. Thank you. Sit back and enjoy this read. You guys, happy Halloween to you guys. And I hope you guys are having a blessed weekend. All right. So let me get some cards to drop. Okay. Okay. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel. Why they walked away. Romance of a lifetime while they walked away. From Virgo. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away. Okay. <sighs> the four of swords. They may feel like they needed rest. Something like they needed rest or break. The three of swords. Yeah, they, they, they feel like they needed some rest. Because um, they feel like you broke their heart. So they feel like they needed a separation because their heart was broken. And they felt like they couldn't rest unless they were separated from you. Man, yeah. The Knight of Cups. Even though they do love you. They did love you, but they were heartbroken. Maybe you put them in a third party or something. You offer love somewhere else. So they were heartbroken. And they, they, they couldn't rest. Their soul couldn't rest. So they needed us. They felt like they had to separate from you to be able to rest. Yeah. Yeah. The situation between you guys were dead. You were exposed. Something was exposed. A third party. Yeah. Or this was you. You were trying to bring something that was dead back to life with someone else that you had them in a third party with. You felt like this was your fulfillment. This person that you were trying to um, bring something back to life or you're trying to bring back to life what you have with this person because they're your fulfillment. But they're feeling like time away from you. Um, they're needing time away from you so they can rest. They're needing to separate. That's why they want to separate. Yeah, they can't get out of their mind. Mental and physical struggle. They can't get out. Of, they may have seen you with a third party. And they can't get it out of their mind. They're going through a mental and physical struggle. And it's like it's... You know, forgetting this, what you did to them. They're forgetting. They, they can't forget that you put them in a third party. They could have seen you with this person and messed their head up. They messed this person's head up that you, you're with. So they're feeling like if they separate from you, they can get the rest that they need. You know, their soul could be at ease. Their mind could be at ease. You know? Um, Romance of a Lifetime on why... Yeah, that's what's going on. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. And they feel like they can move forward into success and whatever they want to be successful in. You know, because this is holding them back. Them being mentally stuck and physically stuck on either seeing what you did or just knowing what you did. It just it can't get it out of their head. And it's keeping them stuck and moving forward in anything and being successful, you know, or even being with you. Okay? So they feel like if they separate from you, they could rest, their soul could rest, and they could move forward in a success with whatever they're working on being successful at as well. The Knight of Wands. 
All right. And this person may be moving out from up under you. And they want to, they may want to do it quickly. Seven of Wands, because they're tired of fighting you off. Maybe they feel like being up under a roof with you, living with you, they have to continuously fight you off, fight how they feel about you. Because they do they do love you. So they feel like if they move out, um they they no longer have to fight you off. Take a rest. It could be at peace. You know. Um, romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Yeah. So that's why they walked away. Mm. So that's why they're taking a leap of faith. And it may be an Aries. They could be taking a leap of faith with the Aries. Or there's an Aries that wants another chance with your person as well. Yeah, want the uh, reunion with them. Somebody that may be coming to visit them or somebody may have already visited them, this person. They want to take a leap of faith or want another chance with your person. And they're fighting for their attention. Yep. So you have some competition. Anyways, this person is competing for their attention against you anyways. All right. The Knight of Swords. They're rushing in. They may be moving into where your person is. To get this attention. To keep it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Yep. Yep. They're going to force it. Yep, because they miss your person. The person that's walking away from you. Um, romance of a lifetime on why they're walking away from Virgo. Yep, they see your person as an empress. They love everything about your person. They put your person on a pedestal. They look up to that per your person. They end the things with a Scorpio because they're obsessed with your person. Romance of a lifetime on why they're walking away from Virgo. Yep. Yep, they want to marry your person. So now your person is leaving you because they feel you put them in a third party or they seen it happen and they can't get over it. Now they're leaving and it's giving this person, this Aries, a chance to win your person over. Yep. The Eight of Cups. Yeah, this person walked away. Or they want your person to walk away from you as well. Um, Romance of a Lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. Yep. They want your person to walk away. Cut. And have a new beginning with them. They want, yep, they want your person to walk away, cut you off, and have a new beginning with them, of stability with them. Because this is how they see your person as stable, secure, beautiful, seductive, strong, stable. Wow. Um,. Romance of a lifetime on why they walked away from Virgo. The Queen of Wands. Yeah, they see your person as very seductive. And again, stable, fun, exciting, flirtative. They love that about your person. Queen of Wands. Your person um, may have Leo in their chart. I know they have Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And they have some Leo. And this Aries, they have Capricorn, Taurus in their chart. Or some of you guys, is Capricorn, Taurus, Aries. Yep, and this is a secret. They don't even share this secret with your um person. And this is a secret. They hide this. They don't share this 
This Aries does not tell this air sign Leo this how they feel. Mm-mm-mm. person maybe a reader a tarot reader it could be um romance of a lifetime a spiritualist yeah leo strong leo your person has strong leo yeah they hold on it's a secret that's why they hold on to your person they tug on their heart strings because they hold a lot of passion for them and they want this passion in the beginning with them romance of a lifetime on why, yeah. And you may be married to this air sign. Yeah, they can't get this person out of their mind. They have nostalgia. Somebody from their past. Somebody, a soulmate. They have a bond. All right? So that's what's going on in water signs. Some of you, it's a water sign. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Yeah. They feel like this is their soulmate. And they can't get them off their mind. All right? And you can make you may be married to this person, some of you guys. All right. Oh. Mm. All right, Virgos. So that's the end of your um reading. I hope I could give you guys some insight. Keep your eyes open. I wish you luck in this situation. Again, hit the notification button below to be notified when I post a video. Like, share my video, comment below, you guys. Hit the join button to be. Uh, a member of my channel and most of all subscribing viewers i thank you guys for tuning in all right peace love and happiness to y'all again happy halloween and continue to have a blessed weekend all right love you guys good night